Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel and in today's video, I'm gonna show you how to create this Netflix inspired presentation in Canva. And the most amazing thing is, you don't need a premium account to create all of these beautiful slides. Okay, before getting into our tutorial video, please click like and subscribe for my channel. And let's get started. Okay, so on the home page of Canva, click presentation. And then we will have a blank canvas like this. And the next thing that you need to do is to set up the background. And look for the word Netflix in the element section okay so as you can see we have the word Netflix here and the next thing that we need to do is to add some text box the font that I'm using here is Norwester the trick here is to use the color that we got from the word Netflix and apply it into the text box. And now we need to turn this text box into a curve, just like the word Netflix. In order to do that, we need to download it as a PPTX file in PowerPoint. Okay, so we will go to format session and here we will choose text effects. I will choose the transformation as the curve like this and let's scale down it a little bit okay since we finished let's copy it and bring it back to canva okay as you can see it has a background like this in white so the next thing that we need to do is to remove the background i will use the background remover tool in canva or you can go online and choose a random background remover website that you can find okay so for the second slide i will you know add some netflix background that i found on google Okay, we just need to copy it and paste it right here. Don't care about the cat, you know. Okay, so we will add another text box right here. And then I will create a search box. We just need two rectangles and then change the color of one of them. And then next, we will add the word Netflix. Okay, so I would add a text box, another text box inside of the search box. Okay, so here is the place where you type in your email account. You can hold down Ctrl D to duplicate the slide and and in this slide I will change the text box into my email account. So 
So for the fourth slide is the slide where we introduce members of a team and I will find some pictures in right here in the element section. Okay, so you can add some titles on top and make it bigger like this. Okay, I'll put it right here. And don't forget to put in the Netflix logo to make it more realistic. To add the white border around the picture, let's go to shadow section and here I'll choose the glow effect. Okay, so remember to adjust the clarity and opacity so that we will have a white border like this. So for this one, I will adjust the brightness uh, a little bit so that it looks brighter than the others. Okay, the next step is to duplicate the fourth slide and make it into the fifth. So for this one, I will recover the first picture by clicking on this button. And let's scale down the picture a little bit okay so for this slide we will do the same thing that we did to the first picture to the second one okay i will also add the white border around it and adjust the brightness of it And for this slide, remember to change the background image so that it will match the transition. So for the rest of the slides, I will do pretty much the same thing. Okay, let's go to shape and make a button right here. So for the last slide, I would add in a rectangle and reduce the opacity of it.
this night I will make a menu so that you can choose the title for your presentation. I'll add in a picture right here and put the name of the group on it. You can go to the element section and choose several icons. I'll make it into three sections. So for each one, I'll put in the text, the title of the presentation. Okay, so I have three of them like this. So it's time to make the content. Okay, to illustrate this, I will need some long text. So I would just go to Google and find some dummy text right here. Copy it and then paste it in my slide. So the next thing that I will do is to create a button so that when we click on it, we can return to the previous slide. So to make it more beautiful, I will add in a picture of a city and I will remove the background of it. Rotate it like this and reduce the transparency. The next one it will be the cinema inspired slide. So I will look at for the word red glow and find a curtain like this.
reduce the transparency a little bit and bring it backwards. Okay, add some text in and add some stars around to make it more beautiful. Okay, so the next one will be about the environment and we'll do pretty much the same thing except for the decoration right here. Okay, so now is the most important part that is adding hyperlink. Okay, so for the first icon, I will just hold down the Ctrl K keys and then link it to the slide of graphic design. Okay, so just click OK. And the next icon will be about urbanization right here okay the last one will be about environment and remember that I created a button that helps you return to the home page slide okay it's pretty much the same thing that I did which is adding a hyperlink So for the last slide, you can make it into the summary slide or a thank you slide. Okay, I'll just make it simple like this. And this is our result. You can do this online or you can download it into the PowerPoint. Either way is okay. And I hope you guys like my tutorial. Stay happy, stay healthy, and see you in my next video. Goodbye.